All right, everybody, welcome. Uh, first view lobby of the day, we are doing rainbow only. That means from left to right, you have to have a rainbow squad. So you have to have a red pet in this one, then orange, yellow, green, blue. You don't have to buy them in that order. So I can take a red and then a green and then a blue. That is fine. You don't need to fill up left to right. But as long as the colors are in their like, set slots, then it is all good. Uh, Bluebird is more interesting than fish, but I didn't know if I'd find another one, so I <laughs> took everything. But yeah, aside from that, guys, it's, this, it's the usual thing of like, slots allowed, all foods allowed, and you know, anything goes in the shop phase. And let's be the inedible portals, and then I'm going to quickly change my hats. And I would change the background, and I still might, but... Yeah, I don't know. There is a rainbow hat somewhere, so I want to find that at least. Yeah, there's rainbow hats. Uh... Maybe stay on this background for now. I think that would maybe be good like, in the future, but I don't have most of the most of the other ones. Alright. Rainbow pack looks very pretty. It does, yeah. And hey, look, I have a full squad. Okay, I'm probably not going to freeze moth. Yeah, I mean dromedary is better at the very least. So I'd probably swap in a dromedary. Not that I want it. I'd rather find like some of this stuff, but. Yeah, late game, these are definitely the stuff you want. Either like lionfish, leopard, or highland cow. Hmm. But yeah, send it. Not much I can do anyway. Excited to join the second one. Yeah, haven't found out what we're going to be doing yet, but hope you enjoy it. Okay, peacock, pretty big fan of that. I was thinking about keeping frogs, so I can, you know, frog swap something else later. But I also really don't want to lose, and <laughs> I don't know, uh... Hmm. I don't know, like, of the stuff I currently have, or could maybe get, what would I even swap with? I could Salamander Scale, but there's no swappy thing. I think I'd just get rid of Frog. Get rid of Frog, just make that larger. Yeah, let's do this. Alright, don't care about Meat Bone. Don't really care about Salamander either. It's probably better than this, but I don't actually want to do too much to buy selling. Yes, okay, cool. And send it again. I just want this to be really large so I can give it garlic in a couple of turns time. Then that'll, you know, carry me, hopefully. It's just sad you missed the lobby. Yeah, there's always more, though. Don't worry too much. Uh, oh, God, yeah. If I didn't buy the food that turn, I think I would have lost. My, my backline guy wouldn't have traded very well. Like, I can buy Meat Bone. I really, I really don't want anything currently on my team, though. If I sold this. Next turn, it actually could be good. But I still don't know if it's worth freezing as it is. Maybe I just buy an apple and give something honey. Hmm. I'm gonna give it to you. I, I don't think it's worth trying to get like a different red pet on my team for a while. Like I'd love to have an octopus at some point. And you know, I can see the value of a lobster, but yeah. Hold on. I'll get a proper look through these. That's backwards by the way. But yeah, I'll get a proper look at the teams after this, I think. Oh god, I am lucky my moth clutched that. <laughs> I would have got a very bad trade otherwise. Oh wait, I can actually get a combo. That's not what I wanted a combo on, but finding an early tier 4 could be pretty nice. Really doubt I'd want a <laughs> mantis, but it does exist. Lobster. You know what? I think I sell moth ladybug and then I buy lobster hatching chick, because that would be very nice for you. Okay. Maybe we could have bought and sold that. That's actually not bad. Let's freeze it. I think that could be worth it. Like, the, the fish is barely doing anything. But I really do need to find garlic for this. But, yeah. For now, this is fine. And, yeah. Let's have a look through the teams, then. Again, please. That is backwards. I need a three squad there. Interesting. Seeing a lot of, like, <laughs> frogs and peacocks there. And a smidgen of toads. Okay, that could have gone a lot worse. Still fine. And avocado. I think I do want to buy avocado. Yeah, I want. I definitely want avocados. Maybe I leave this. Hmm. Yeah, I'm. I'm going to leave it. It's like better than the fish. But if I can just buy loads of avocados next turn and then maybe find some combos, then all of that would be a lot, a lot nicer for me. Stoves also may be fine, but I'm not risking. <laughs> I'm just not risking it. Same with clownfish. Like, it's good to freeze to try and, you know, 
if I find levels or something, but yeah, we're fine. Didn't like any of this, sadly. Alright, let's just roll the rest away. Okay, not too bad. I will be buying the chipmunk on there. I don't know if I should try and give it, like, I don't know, a banana or something so I can get, like, another one back for free. Probably worth it, but I don't know if it's worth, um, rolling for, you know? You're running Mantis. I look forward to seeing it. Ah, oh, that's a loss. Okay. Well, not on full HP anymore, but kinda, kinda had it coming. This is not, like, the strongest team I've ever seen. Triceratops is a pretty interesting thing. Whale is also a lot better than fish, but I'd rather, like, dragonfly, probably. Because it's actually a scaler. Uh, yeah, it's not like this is the best um, orange, but it's probably good for a while. Do I even buy sell this to get more stats on there? Probably not. Okay, let's roll a bit to see if I can find a good equipment. Preferably not potato. Or these... <laughs> Come on. Uh, actually, I'll do this. That's fine. Alright, so then I can buy you, give that to these two. Sell you, put that there. And then I'm looking for a pill. And you know what? Maybe even freeze that. Maybe should have frozen this as well. Like, banana's pretty good. Okay, it seems like it would be no problem. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the garlic clutched. So hard. Okay, leveling the hatching chick. I don't love it. Yeah, I, I wanted to find like different stuff as soon as possible, so I think I'm going to leave that. I think a banana over here is fine, because I'm going to be pilling it at some point anyway. Debating what to do with these. Like, I could stack that there. I think I will, honestly. But, oh yeah. And then by this, it's all good. So right now, my most expendable slots are yellow and red. And I'm, I'm not, like, locked into anything else, but they're a lot bigger, so I'd rather not get rid of them too early. Oh. Okay, I think Monkey actually saved me there, because this would have taken a massive hit otherwise. Yeah, look at that. Almost made it to 50 attack. Very solid. And, yeah, <laughs> still don't care about this. Uh, again, Lemon is better than these things. So like, that makes it a maybe, but... Long term, I probably want to have a different orange because either Sabretooth or Tiger there would be very nice. So I don't know whether I actually do that or not. I'm going to roll for now. I need to find... um. I need to find chocolates or something. Okay, a level. Show me something good. Dragon. I would have to get rid of the peacock and then I'd have to have an open slot, but that is a way to scale. I think I'll freeze it and then buy that. Yeah, let's do this. Okay. Okay, next turn. <laughs> next turn, I'm going to do something crazy. And I'm going to have a lot of money for it. But I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't. Because although I'd love to have a dragon and start scaling with it, uh, I don't have the things that I want to scale yet. I keep killing my backline before I can do anything. Okay, again, look at the peacock. So much damage. And when I sell it, I'm definitely going to die. <laughs> All right. Okay. No, unfreeze everything. I need to get this thing leveled up. So I need... There we go. Okay, put it on there. Island Cow is also very nice. Okay, this next. Again, Monkey is not yellow, so you can't just keep that. Double Island Cow! Amazing. Okay. <laughs> uh, Yeah, no, buy both. Buy both, do that. Buy you. Can't keep it there. I could maybe sell it to buy the dolphin or something, but yeah, I'm just going to buy sell other things, I think. Okay. I will freeze that. These are going to be very nice, because if I find another dragon or Highland cow, then it's, you know, potential XP. Huge pivots. Yeah. It wasn't insane this turn, but it actually wasn't that bad, because I get to summon an extra, like, well, 6-6, <laughs> six, six, apparently. But, yeah, it'll, it'll get there. It's going to take some time. I knew it was bigger. It's because they they skunked it or something. Where does HP go? I guess he got sniped at the start. Oh, a leopard might be a lot nicer. Mm. <laughs> okay, okay, we're pivoting again. <laughs> we're a leopard squad now. 
All right, this is level two, so I'm going to start like buy selling now, but I may still pivot in some other stuff. Okay, freeze these. Pep is fine, but yeah, ideally I'd be able to find a tiger and an octopus because that'd be much nicer than these two. I have enough HP, so I could probably survive this. But yeah, and let's see what people are running then. I actually did see an octopus up there. Hmm. You've got Tiger Leopard. Ah, shame. Okay. Okay, 3 HP. I've still got some time. I think that on there is great, and it might show me another tier 6 that I want. Fly. <laughs> so, while I do enjoy Fly, I don't think a frontline Fly is um, the play for this one, unless they happen to snipe my backline. I should probably buy this, honestly. Take that, sell you again. Leave these. T-Rex. Also scaling, but I'm already locked in on the dragon, so I think I'll be... <laughs> definitely be leaving that. And yeah, I don't know if I can actually get rid of the T-Rex anymore. Triceratops, I mean. Because I'd, I'd kind of like to. feel like it's going to be very difficult. And what else have we got down here? Seeing a lot of octopuses now. Uh, they kind of crushed their team together in a weird way, but it's fine, I guess. Okay. Is Fly not gray? You may be on the old version or something. Because, uh, yeah, depending on which art stuff you have available, it's it looks different. Okay. I do enjoy Sabertooth Tiger as well, though. Let's take a Sabertooth. That's also a fine one, and who knows when I'd ever find an actual tiger, so... Yeah, let's buy-sell. And I'm gonna buy-sell the Blueing Doctopus as well. It's not quite as good as a tier 1, but... Actually, do I? Do I? Because I'd like to scale, like... I'd like to scale with the dragon until I can get rid of the dragon, and then I can just run, like, some other thing. So I don't actually care about stats on this. I'm gonna roll twice for the tier 1s instead. Wow. <laughs> okay, we found nothing. Shame. And I'm also now noticing that melon doesn't exist, because I've been kind of waiting to see a, a melon to buy for this. But I guess I need to freeze a turtle if I want that. You're looking to fly in the shop? I don't know. It looks looks like it has blue in it to me. Anything where there's any sort of like subjective thing involved is just way too hard. Because people are going to disagree about what colors things are. Like, a lot of people were saying that crabs were red, and, like, how do you, how do you argue, I have an argument like that, you know? Like, this is nothing. Alright, I could buy an avocado, but I feel like I need to roll anyway, so, let's do it. Don't care about any of this. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to level you. Another one of these. Again, I could freeze a pill or something, I'd rather not, though. Like, I would like to find chocolate, so. Yeah, I think I'll freeze a turtle before the pill. He died to a 54 pet. Was it like a salamander? <laughs> I'm trying to think how anyone could have a 54. Oh. oh, safe. Okay. I was worried that would have been weird, but I think my backline would have saved me anyway. And yeah. Lobster, just there's just no chance it's going anywhere. <laughs> I think this is the permanent part of the squad now. Alright. Stack that and roll. More of these, excellent. I should probably have bought a lemon. I don't know why I didn't do it earlier. And yeah, leave the blurring octopus. We're fine. We're fine. And hmm, make a lemon for my backline is also a good idea because there's a lot of people running like these things, and there's probably a few crocodiles around as well. So I think having lemon on there could actually be better than melon. And who knows, maybe some people have, like, tiny leopards and they'll actually be able to, like, block a fair amount of damage, too. Am I sad about pills going up to two gold? I am, and I'm really hoping they don't go through that change. Because it doesn't really feel right. Okay, still safe. Okay, keep going. I wish there was a, you know, I don't know, I guess there is fish. But I don't think I've seen a fish, so I haven't been able to end on a <laughs> on a thing for a while. Okay, you know, I'm just going to buy these instead of the tail ones. 
What am I doing? I wanted to put it on that in this. I don't know why I threw it on the leopard. Okay, well that was a mistake, but still an improvement. And honestly, at some point I might I may just um you know play an actual blue thing. I'm wondering what it'd be though. Like I probably don't need a piranha. Frontline fly doesn't feel right if I don't have things that are likely to die at the back. Swordfish could be interesting, but I don't have a good way to scale it. It would be good if I had the like T-Rex scaling or something, but yeah. I don't know. Ah. <laughs> okay. Well, that's fine. My guy's kind of ruining the rainbow by spawning other colored things and like out of order. Shame on him. <laughs> Alright. Well, at least I'm coming towards the end of like needing to scale because we're getting a lot of stats every turn. Uh, level you and do that next turn? Oh, yeah. Obviously, I could buy and sell this. I would never, though. I also don't know if it's worth leveling the lobster or not. I feel like it wouldn't be, because it would only really affect, like, the temporary things I have here, or, you know, by the time I get a permanent blue thing, then that. So, ignore. Ignore. Go forward. What do you think is the best scaling pet? If you mean in this pack... Then, I don't know, probably T-Rex. If you mean in general, then Black Cat. Like, all day, every day, Black Cat. It's insane what you can do with Black Cats. Stoats? Yeah, there's a pretty good chance to turn into something useful. Hey, it did. Perfect. Alright. If I sell that, buy this. I know I could buy a banana. I won't. We just roll. Another one of these is fine to freeze, I think. Yes, yes, so many good things. And there's... There's the octopus that I wanted for ages that I'll probably now never be able to use. Yeah, if I swapped in this octopus like and kept scaling with my dragon, then there's just... It would be way too small and I'd be wasting stats on here, so it wouldn't even be worth it, so... We say goodbye to octopus. Oh, that's a lot of things. Uh, <laughs> okay, leave that behind. Really hoping to get a, a leopard out of my stoats. Ah, the mushroom. <laughs> I died to a clone. Pain. Oh, yo, okay. Uh, you know what? We wait on the stoats. I know everything's shuffled. I'll move it back in a minute, but yeah. <laughs> We're definitely doing this. And yeah, Tiger would have been great here as well. And I kind of wanted to do that instead of Sabretooth, but I think this is the first Tiger I found. So it wasn't exactly my choice. I should also maybe unfreeze this now. Because I, I can definitely replace dragon. I don't think I can replace lobster. So I can get a blue and a green thing if I really want. But what would be what would be the better things there? I can see stoat being really uh sorry, toad being pretty good. And then I don't know, swordfish maybe? Hmm. hmm we'll see. <laughs> Mushroom OP. If I had another uh tomato, then I actually think I would have been okay though. And this team is terrifying. Ooh. Okay. I'm still going to buy sell for a bit, because I want these two to be, like, capped out. Leave steak. Leave steak. Just keep doing this. If I die this turn, then I die this turn. It's all good. Maybe end up in a piranha, though. Just so it's less likely to get me killed this turn. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. All right. Alright, let's have like one final look at the teams. Again, I don't know why this person has had their stuff back to front the whole time. Uh, there's actually quite a lot of variety. I am seeing mostly <laughs> T-Rex scaling, but yeah, I don't know. Interesting. Oh, pain. Okay, at least I... well, no, I'm dead. <laughs> oh god, it's always the mushroom thing. Alright, well, I'm still happy with my team. Like, I managed to get my 50 attack level 3 leopard and, you know, a massive level 3 uh, saber tooth. It did, kept, it did keep getting, like, one-shot by things, which was pretty disappointing. But overall, very solid team. Not unhappy with that. So, GG's, GG's. Alright, everybody, welcome. Uh, that last level was very short for me, so <laughs> we're doing another quick one. This time it's going to be a little bit complicated, but everything to the right of your pets has to be a higher tier, and you can't have any duplicates. The idea here is that it's just going to be like, you know, tier 1, tier 2, 3, 4, 5. But if you want, you can skip tiers or just go for even higher stuff, so 
as long as everything to the right of it is a higher tier, then that's all that matters. So it basically just means you can only have like one tier one and, you know, so forth. So going for an early combo actually isn't a bad thing. I think a cricket is an alright start as well. Maybe give it honey. And yeah, stack that. That's fine. Okay, so there we go. There's my team. I actually could run him all the way at the right if I wanted to, but <laughs> it is fine there at the moment. And I'm going to take a minute to um change hats and stuff. You know what? Bowler hat. Bowler hat, and we are going to the front yard. Let's do this. And I need to stop sitting at my legs. I'm getting, like, <laughs> pins and needles in my foot. Oh, cool. I'll take a trade. No worries, no worries, dude. Uh, oh, wait, maybe I wait for um next tier. So I'll probably keep this for a very long time, because there's no point getting rid of it until I have um like tier sixes to find or something. But if I do the combo next turn, then I can both get a tier three and just find tier twos. So yeah, I'm going to wait on that, I think. I don't think I'm going to go for extra either. Let's just um, get some stats on here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So, yes, uh, Jonico, please sell everything. That is not what we're doing. Again, Apcal, please remove. Okay, most people seem to at least be doing okay so far. Void's very full, yeah. Hey, they had a crab. Damn, okay. Alright, so this is where I'm going to combo. I could take a flamingo as well, but. Again, it would have to be in the second position, and I don't know how I feel about that. I'll freeze it in case one doesn't show up. Hedgehog? Uh, you know what? I'm going to take this just so I can pill it later. But I think I'm just going to buy, like, apples for this. So, yeah, this is only going to hit one thing, but that's not too bad. So how's this looking? Oh, yeah, elephant's going to be a bit rough as well. Better than nothing, definitely, but... A slot than any slot, yes. Again, normal rules. Any food, anything goes in the shop phase and slot anywhere. Okay, rats. <laughs> nah, I think I'm okay without rats. This is by this. Yeah, by another... Oh, we don't talk about that one. We don't talk about that one. Okay. God, this massive beaver. Why do you have a level 3 beaver but nothing else yet? Like, how does that happen? Why have you avoided buying other things? It makes no sense. Although I guess it maybe could have been a giraffe, but... Yeah. <laughs> Ox, oh, snail. Don't be mean, I like my beavers. It was you, okay. Never mind, that makes sense. See, if it was me, I would have bought it anyway, just because it's a thing. <laughs> but I guess you, like, didn't take it out of spite. Fair enough. Okay. And then, if I get a combination, then I can maybe find a tier 4, but I don't know if I'm going to push for that. Uh, like, I can combine. I really don't want to, though. What would be a good thing? Like, a peacock is a pretty good, um, like, late game tier 2. So I could maybe just try and find one of those and swap that in instead. I don't think I'm going to do anything here, though. Yeah, I'd, like, I'd rather buy salads if I'm buying anything. Oh, kangaroo is also very nice. Yeah, let's just get rid of this. No, I can't buy a kangaroo. What am I doing? Damn, okay. Uh, Buy this, buy that. And then we look for another tier 2 soon, because my brain isn't working. Get a shrimp. I don't think I want to do, like, buy selling with this. I just want to find decent things. Like, I might not keep this forever. Honestly, this is probably an improvement for me this turn, but... Yeah. Early throw. Nah, that was actually, like, an improvement, honestly. <laughs> it's not what I wanted to do, but it was, um, better for me. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it. Like, this is, this is fine. Let's buy a cricket. Buy crickets, and then we'll wait for tier fours instead. Yeah, so peacock would be fine, but we'll wait. Trying to level that up would be nice as well. What's the tier two play? I mean, it's more like just having a cricket. Sorry, having having stats on big thing is better than having stats on little thing without equipment. So, yeah, having nothing here right now is actually better for me. Not that I want to leave it that way forever, but 
you know. Anyway, I'm gonna freeze that and might just throw it down. One. You know what? Take this, freeze cans, and then we're going to buy a load of cans and I may be able to swap everything out at some point if I really need. Hmm. This is fine. Yeah. Alright, cool. Very sorry. Okay, another whale. I mean, I could stack it on top. I don't really want a whale, but I don't know whether it's worth buying, like, big skunk. Hold on, what tier 4 do I actually want, like, long term? Because I could go for a food build, because having, like, squirrel, seal, black cat is very solid. You can always see, like, monkey scaling, like, a leopard or something as well. I don't know. I think I do take this, though. Like, skunk's a pretty nice tier 4. Going to leave that. I don't think I'm going to go for the cricket level up. Like, you know, <laughs> it's fine. I don't think I care that much. Skunk definitely better. Sorry, I, what I meant was I know it's a lot better. I didn't know whether it was worth um actually swapping in. Because this thing's ability right now would barely do anything. Not that the whale one was going to do anything helpful. But yeah, I was wondering if I just kind of leave it there and then, you know, swap in something else when I find a cool tier 5. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> yeah, that was very close. Alright, chocolate. So I could do this to see a tier 6 this turn. I really want to do that. Okay, show me. Show me what you've got. It's a cat. Okay, I'm getting rid of the skunk. <laughs> We're going for food. Let's go. Okay, so I have one, three, four, six. That is fine. Chili is also fine to discount. Seal, there's my tier five. Canned foods. Uh, yeah, canned foods. <laughs> yeah, no, no monkey. We're, we're food scalers now. That doesn't look great for me. Okay, well, honestly, this was a long time coming, because I don't think I've had the strongest team for quite a while. So, yeah, I'll take that. I don't think I need to sell anything. I think this just is the team now. So, yeah. <laughs> we buy... We buy... No. No snail. I was hoping for stat food there. But, yeah. One, three, four, five, six. All is well. We just need to find levels and stat food, really. You know, and maybe some, like, steaks, because these guys are not going to do too well with melon to start, I think. This one might. I doubt this one really needs it. Level 2 monkey into boar. Damn. Oh, someone else has a black cat. Very nice. Kind of liking frontline monkey as well, actually. Another food bill? They've got, like... Well, they don't have the black cat, but... Yeah. <laughs> okay, another black cat. Dude, there's so many black cats! So many people got early black cats. I'm going to lose again. I don't love that. <laughs> Hopefully I have some time to fix this. Alright, pair's cool. Uh, leveling the squirrel is also very nice. Yeah. Okay, I'm probably going to buy the mushroom just because it's already here. Oh, I don't know. Maybe the garlic. Garlic's better than nothing. Throw it on... Yeah, throw it on there. What am I doing? I can't rearrange. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, I do want to have um, steak on both of these, though. Probably on here as well, honestly. But yeah, I'm definitely not just going to put steak on it before these guys have anything. Yeah, there's like a ton of food scaling and like a good handful of monkeys. And a lot of boars, too. A team I'm stronger than. Nice. Okay, stop. Where's the good food? Uh, I'm leaving the mushroom. It's not worth anything. Sushi. Nice. Uh, pizza. Melon. I don't know. It is an improvement on, like, quite a lot of this stuff. I can maybe throw it on the back there, because I did see a few crocodiles around, and blocking an 8 damage snipe probably makes more sense than garlic, and, you know, again, this is going to be 1 gold. Alright, cool. Still going. Still 3 HP, and hopefully I'll be able to, I don't know, get my cat leveled up would be really nice. Haven't found any chocolates for a very long time, if it, like, if any. Aha! <laughs> yeah, on the cat. On the cat. I almost want to level this up as well. I think I just buy the pizza. I could freeze this, maybe. How long is this game going to last? 
I think this may be worth going for. I need to level both of these first, but if I buy this and I find two more in the shop between now and like three turns time or something, then it'd be great value, so yeah. Streamer luck, streamer luck. Hey, if I can get this leveled up, then sure, you can call me out for streamer luck, but right now that makes like no difference. <laughs> for all I know, I'm going to be like dead or have won the game with a level one cat. And then it just won't do anything. It's like buying a... It's worse than an apple because it doesn't even get the stat like doubled. <laughs> See, they have stakes. Where are my stakes? Alright. Okay, well, I think melon on there makes sense. And then I'm probably just going to stack all the chili on here. And give one to the camel, maybe. Nah, I don't want to have one of those on the camel. So yeah, we'll just do that. I am going to buy this. And I want both of these as well. Start with that, and then we can freeze the other one. This is still going fine. I'm definitely not going to pivot, though. Like, I'm pretty locked into what I have. You ask for something, your shop provides. I ask for something, my shop does the opposite. Fair. I can't lie, it does seem to happen at weird moments. Also, that is a problem. That was very close to being a win. If I had, like, four more HP or something. <laughs> or I probably needed more attack as well, to be honest, but... Huh. Okay, I'm gonna buy these now. I'm not gonna buy this. It is a 2-2, but I'd much rather have that equipment and... Yeah. Just rather roll. Just buy it. Buy it, send it. Hmm. No. <laughs> no, it was so close. Oh, I'm just dead. Okay. I, I thought I had more HP. Whoops. Hold on, that was quick. Okay. <laughs> okay, everybody, welcome. We're doing snipers only in the turtle pack. So when you end your turn, when you have things that... Uh, basically, when you hover over it, if it has a rock, then you're allowed to use it. So anything that throws rocks, you're allowed mosquito, uh, elephant, crocodile, I don't know, all those things. Other than that, all food is allowed. Anything goes in the shop phase, and you are allowed a soth. So go crazy. And you know what? I'm probably going to buy this because I feel like I may end up needing that. Another one of these is great. Swap those two around, but send it. And we will be the lazy fighters. Okay. And then I'm going to take a minute to change hat and background again. I still don't know if there's any good sniper hats. I don't know what this is, but I've never used it. So maybe that one. <laughs> oh, feather hat. That kind of makes sense. And... Jungle? Jungle. Okay. Let's do it. There's a bullseye hat. I also didn't know, but also I haven't... There's like a ton of hats I've never had on before, so... Yeah, it makes sense that I don't remember all of them. Uh, Roll... No. Buy it, roll once. Oh, cool. <laughs> I was gonna say, if I found like another apple, then I'd rather buy that, but we actually found another mosquito, so... Even better. Kind of makes me wish I had put... Well, I guess not honey on something else, but the buff, but... Oh well, this all works. Alright. Dude, I kind of like B with the Robin Hood hat. Or whatever they called this. Archer hat, maybe? And yeah, can't use any of these. But we are at tier 2, so now there's Hedgehog and Elephant. So I think those are the only snipers from tier 2. I could also combine, and I may get lucky and find a Dolphin. But I think Dolphin might be the only one, so <laughs> maybe I wait on that. I think for now, I just keep pumping this. Yo, they both showed up! Uh, <laughs> do I want them both? Hold on. I mean, maybe. It's kind of funny. Okay, I'm going to take that. If this dies to someone else's Hedgehog, then my team is screwed. Like, <laughs> I do have a summon, but... Ooh, a bit scary. Alright. Blowfish 2. True. True, true, true. Hmm. <laughs> do I do it now? Like, if I'm going to combine, then again, there's like nothing I can get from tier 4. And I really doubt I'm waiting for this combination until tier 5, so I guess I do do it now. Badger. Like, it's a sniper, but is it a sniper that I want? And I'm kind of thinking that my answer is no. The odds of it, like, sabotaging my own team are too high. So I'm going to roll past that, I think. 
kind of want to buy the apples, but I don't know. Freeze one maybe and roll. If I can find another hedgehog, then oh, maybe not actually. I think these are going to stay, so I'm actually going to do this. Let's just make these kind of large. So this is very unlikely to die to my own hedgehog now. It would have to get sniped by like two mosquitoes or something. Or, you know, someone else's hedgehog somewhere. Is there going to be another view lobby after? Uh, yes. We're going to be going for another 50 minutes, and I really doubt this one's going to last for <laughs> that long, so... Should be at least one more after this. And, uh... Ah, wait, I have a summon. I have a summon, so I am better. <laughs> right. Uh, we roll. Again, I could be buying apples, but I won't. Dolphin's pretty nice. I think, stack that in there. I want a dolphin. I could put this here, and then it's pretty likely to survive all the random spam. But I also don't know how much I want it. Because I feel like an elephant's probably one of the worst things on my team, so I may throw this on here instead. I know it's not, like, behind my hedgehogs, but... Yeah. Alright. It's going to be a while until I can get rid of that as well. Maybe throw garlic on it. There's a few big things at the front, but most of them aren't that big, so... Yeah, garlic on there could be useful. Hopefully this will be fine. Going for Hedgehog Blowfish. I kind of like that strat. I think Blowfish would be pretty good in this. At least for the early game. If someone somehow make, uh, manages to get like massive leopards, then... You know. <laughs> I don't think the tiny sight backs are going to be, you know, too great. But, uh, yeah. For most of the game, I imagine it'd be pretty good. Alright, stack that there by this. I'm not going to put a garlic on either of these. Like, the elephant's going the second I find something better. That is a combo for next turn. And never mind, I put this on here then. <laughs> I swear it keeps dying to my own hedgehog, so like, maybe this will help out. If it can actually survive, so I might be able to get a win, then that'd be great. Yeah, there's some hedgehog blowfish. Ton of mosquitoes around. Actual variety team there. Yeah, no, it's like half the lobby is just uh, mosquitoes. That's an interesting play. I guess they put the this back there, because although it dies their own hedgehogs like spam, it does mean they get to summon at the back instead of dying before the hedgehogs pop off. Yeah, see, this is going to be good value garlic, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. See, it almost died to the random random summons they had. Said I was safe. And yeah, buy this before I do anything with the canned food. Turkey, I actually want to freeze. But I feel like it's too early. Buy canned food, freeze this. Hedgehog. Oh, it could, I could get so much. Like what? Sell elephant. I can't do it this turn, but I could like sell elephant, combine hedgehogs, buy turkey, hedgehog, and then combine hedgehogs together again if I wanted. And that'd be pretty big. But would it actually be worth it? Probably not. Probably not. Okay, ignore turkey, just buy a pear. Send it again. I should probably buy honey, honestly. I don't know whether I put it on this guy, but yeah. The army of bees is pretty cool. I mean, when there's this many hedgehogs around and, you know, everything's just exploding, then having some is actually very good. No! Why would they hit that? Stop! I'm actually getting screwed! Oh my god. Every hit. Every hit. Oh. That's not fair. I'm genuinely upset. <laughs> okay. Uh, do I combine now? I'm more likely to find a rhino or a crocodile than I am, like, just the leopard here. Although a snake could be fine, and I would love that. I can probably wait a turn. Wait a turn and buy the apple. Like, we're already here. Yeah, and I guess this is where I buy one of those. So I'm just going to do this, I think. So I'm fully expecting this to die, like, right at the start somehow. This is probably going to die somewhere as well, but... <laughs> I don't really care. As long as my bee gets summoned right at the back, then that's all I'm after. Game is punishing me for getting too much, like, shop RNG. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, as long as I can still, like, clutch it out and make it to the, like, the end of the game, kind of, then I'm okay with that. Ah. Yeah, my bee got summoned before this guy did anything, so now I'm in a bad spot. Although, I would have died there anyway, so yeah, that's fine. Okay. Oh, double crocodile. I see rhino as well, but I don't really care about that. 
yeah, what do I do here? Elephant's definitely going. I guess I sell dolphin before the mosquito, but yeah, do this and then just feed him some pears. Like, crocodile's definitely one of the better things to have on my team. Like, who knows? Maybe, like, proper late game, I'll end up with, I don't know, <laughs> double croc, triple le uh, leopard. I could maybe fit a snake in there, but I feel like it's too likely to just insta die. Who should a snake go behind? I mean, that's the issue, isn't it? Because you'd want something with honey. Probably. Unless you have something with garlic, but. <laughs> Probably just honey more. Yeah, I have no idea. You just need, like, a large thing, but then you're also at risk of the snake just insta dying, so. Oh, wait. I forgot about this. Yeah, so combine there. Tiger. Yeah, not allowed. Gonna leave the dolphin as well. Like, I could play it, but. Not that interested. And. I don't know. Buy. Buy Rhino. I also do wish I kept my honey. I should have done that the other way. Hmm. Yeah, just buy it to have something on the team. Your health? Why are you both saying your health? Who did I hit? I can't have hit everyone. Oh my god, the rise of Hedgehog Blowfish. It's definitely more than I remember. Someone found an early leopard. Yo! Quad Dolphin team? Oh, health my Kino. I see. Elephant Blowfish. That actually almost made it through. Because half my team was like running out of HP there. I feel like my garlic just kind of <laughs> carried again. Leopards. Ah, uh, Mushroom is also pretty tempting. Okay, I think it may be time to get rid of the Mosquito. Like, it's doing great work, but... Actually, I'd probably get rid of Rhino first, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to do with the Mushroom. It might be able to get me some, like, draws, so I can maybe do this, but... Roll for now. Melon? Melon on something? How many mosquitoes are still around? A lot, yeah. I don't think I want melon, then. I guess I... No. I refuse. Okay, now I'm just getting rid of that. Let's, <laughs> let's just go crazy. Gonna leave Cupcake. Could do something with that. That's nice. And, yeah, no, I'm I'm happy. So next turn, I think I'm going to combine the crocodiles, and then I'm going to buy, sell, yeah, probably like buy pair, buy, sell cow, then buy cats, and then buy the milk and sell cat again, run a four squad. I think that'll be okay. I managed to get like a ton of stats on these. Damn, that was unfortunate. Okay, so yeah, let's do that then. So I'm going to stack these, I think. Stack those, buy a pair, buy, sell you. Make this larger, sell cat again. I could end on a badger, I don't think it's a good idea. <laughs> I just think that is not going to turn out too well for me. Pulling that could be fine. I don't know how important steak would be. Actually, maybe I should have frozen the turkey. I could have combined those two together and then I could have turkey bought the other one and then had some pretty cheap stats and you know still sort of bought everything. Because although I was thinking of ending with this in a separate slot, I also kind of want to keep a slot open to buy sell because you know, buying cows is still pretty good. Can't believe you're still alive. I don't know what sort of team you have. 12 turns, 0 wins. Hey, wins don't matter anyway. As long as you're not losing HP, then it actually doesn't matter. Oh. Oh, God. I actually died to Elephant Blowfish. 1 HP. Okay. Pain. Pain. Alright, just keep doing this then. Buy that. Play another one of these. I don't have any equipment. And honestly, I don't think having um, honey or mushrooms would actually save me here because it's not like I'm dying to a single bee. <laughs> I am dying because their whole team is surviving while mine isn't. So, I don't know. I need more protective equipment. I need garlic on some of these. Or just a ton more stats. Either would be great. Like, I either need to get like bigger snipes so I can insta-kill things. Or I need to be so big that, you know, my own stuff doesn't get insta-killed. Tepolis, hello. Welcome. Your cats are forever hitting bouncy balls across the room. Is enough for a snipe to let them beam in my team. Yes. I actually can completely relate to that because we have ping pong balls all over our house because the cats used to love them. They haven't really used them for a long time, but they're still all around our house. Like, look under any sofa and there's going to be like four ping pong balls. Not that we have that many sofas, but you know. <laughs> they're just everywhere. 
And yeah, just just buy. Buy stuff as they are. I will take a melon because it is some protection. Uh, maybe I should let one of these or both of these get like hit. I probably don't want my hedgehog to, keep, to take crocodile snipes. Maybe I let the leopards take it. Or one of them. It depends if other people are running hedgehogs still. And most people aren't actually. But there is a lot of like tiny snipes still around so they'd probably still die. I don't know. Do it this way maybe. Is it possible to change the shop time? And if so, what is the lowest time? I actually don't know what the lowest time is, but it's definitely below what you'd want it to be. Because I think you can set it to, like, 15 seconds. <laughs> that is not enough time in, like, any world. Oh, I'm dead, huh? No. <laughs> okay. Well, fair enough. Fair enough. That is not top 16. Okay, well, GG's, GG's. Good game. Let me pay that out. Oh, I didn't do a thing. Never mind. Okay, everyone, welcome. Uh, it's a special one. We've got a very speedy lobby. We only have 20 seconds per round. Uh, good luck. <laughs> Just good luck. Nothing else to say. It's going to be rough. Once we did this with a 25 second turn timer, and that was brutal enough. So, yeah, we're trying 20. Let's see. Let's see how bad it's going to get. I've recommended that everyone turn their, you know, thing to fast and their other thing up here to whatever it is, 200%. Okay. Okay, combo. Can maybe keep buying crickets. I think I unfreeze that at the very least, but yeah, leave the crickets. Swap that there. Barely had time. You're going to sabotage everyone with spawns. Oh god, I'm, yeah, I'm doing that myself. I have two crickets now. Go, go, go. Yeah, I got like six seconds left. Uh. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> There's my team. I could have swapped those two around and it would have been fine, but... That's not good. <laughs> and it's only going to get worse as well. I need to get rid of this cricket. Please, hurry. How long do I have? Eight seconds. Yeah, I'm... Uh, I mean, it's okay for now, maybe. Uh, you know what? Just take that. I just don't want to lose. No, I didn't get to freeze my swan! <laughs> I need to get rid of this cricket at some point, but I don't know if I can afford to do it yet. And I'm never going to be able to check the other teams. Like, there's just no time. That's a pretty scary team. I think I am fine, though. My ox is just enough to carry. Okay. Yeah, six seconds again. Uh, hold on. Just roll. No, <laughs> I wasted a gold. That's going to be the first of many. There's definitely going to be some turns where I, like, lose, like, eight gold. I guarantee it. <laughs> Ten gold, yeah. No, they got, like, loads of long things. Oh, my God. I'm going to have no time. I'm not going to have a turn. Just buy whatever food shows up. Okay, yep. <laughs> That's awful. Oh. Imagine missing a sloth because you couldn't freeze it. Oh, yeah, finding a sloth in this is going to be horrible. <laughs> uh, maybe this one's a bit nicer. I think I'm going to get a bit longer for this one, but it's still going to be like six seconds. Okay, just combine there, uh, buy this. You know what, give that. No, I didn't get to buy the garlic. There's no time. <laughs> Alright, there goes six gold. Don't have time to think. Yeah, you literally just have to reflex, try and speed by everything. It's brutal. Okay. Yo, you're out. I'm very sorry. Okay, buy this. Sell you. No, sell, 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 sell. Oh, wait. I actually had time this time. I didn't get to buy everything I wanted, but that was almost a good turn. I <laughs> got down to got down to one gold. That's been a while. Okay. That hippo is not a problem, but this is, I think. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there goes the next thing. Alright. Do that. I know the deer's there and that's fine, but 
Okay, I need to try and make the rooster work. I know it's a summon scum thing, but is is that or I just kind of embrace death? Okay, so reposition that guy if I have time then. That is also going to like insta kill my ox, I think. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, just do that in there, tiger. I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know. I wanted to move the rhino, but yeah, I need to get rid of the cricket still. Uh, I want the tiger, and I guess I throw it behind the rooster, but then that needs to go further back as well. And this is also a loss. Oh no. I'm suddenly losing all of my HP. Okay. Oh, just do that. <laughs> so, I'm Tiger Swan. <laughs> Okay, maybe this guy will get lucky. If no one else could do their turns either, then maybe I'm gonna go against smaller teams. Yeah, see, that wasn't too bad. Okay. Okay, so I just need to move my swan into like second position. Or first, maybe. Oh, you know what, get rid of that. Please, I don't, I don't have time. No, I couldn't buy the steak. Or the monkey, monkey would have been great as well. God, imagine trying to do like dragon scaling with this. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna trade through. Yeah. Okay. Uh, just buy it. Buy it. Pump. I know the tiger thing is not in the right place, but yeah, there's, <laughs> there's no time. I need scaling that isn't like buy sell scaling, because I'm not gonna be able to do it otherwise. Uh, that's a problem. Okay, there's one HP left. Uh, no, the tiger, throw it to the back. Leopards. No, I kind of wanted the leopard. Okay, at least I have, like, tiger thing here. If I don't go against crocodiles, I might be alright. Uh, no. It was very close, but I am dead. Okay, do we have a prediction or no? We do, we're top 15. Okay, so what are we at then? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Not top fifteen then. We're close. It is like top twenty-ish, but yeah, <laughs> I've been defeated. And uh now you can see why we don't do that very often. <laughs>